Hey everybody, Pastor Sarah Ritchie here. Today is June the 23rd. It's a Thursday and I'm the minister of First Christian Church in San Bernardino, California. So good to be with you today. Have you ever heard the expression about walking on water? It's usually spoken in the context of someone is doing something miraculous or big or grand, unexpected. Uh, in the Gospels of Matthew, Mark, and John, Jesus walks on water. Now, they all have a slightly different take on this story. The one I want to read to you, just one verse, actually half of a verse, comes from Mark's version. He says this, very early in the morning, he came to them walking on the lake. He intended to pass them by. <laughs> that part cracks me up. He intended to pass them by. I think of how often perhaps God would prefer to pass us by, but still gets into the boat with us anyway. It's one of the most miraculous and amazing things about our relationship with God and with Jesus Christ, that they would bother to get into the boat with us. And travel with us despite our fears and um, insecurities and um, foibles the whole mess that we happen to be they walk on water our God walks on water to get into the boat with us you know I, I did some reading about this expression walking on water and the one that I thought was the funniest came from of all people Lyndon Johnson he uh, was one of our presidents, as you know, and he was a member of the Christian Church Disciples of Christ. And he said this, If one morning I walked on top of the water across the Potomac River, the headline would read, President Can't Swim. <laughs> I thought that was hilarious. We have such high expectations of ourselves, of our leaders, of our um, religious leaders, political leaders, um, our family members, such high expectations. We think they should be able to walk on water. But walking on water, it's impossible. Try it sometime and you'll see what I mean. I think that we can do all things when we are a people of faith, if we hold on to that faith. We can do unexpected, miraculous, beautiful things. I don't know if we can walk on water, but I do know that we can change the world. So today I invite you all, as you consider this phrase, walking on water, consider the times that you've done beautiful, amazing, unexpected things. How you've surprised the world with your wit or abilities or intelligence or physical acumen or faith whatever it may be and then celebrate that celebrate it in those around you and consider that God got into the boat with us is in the boat with us even when we are utterly frustrating people listen y'all have a wonderful day today take care bye-bye